I'd like to see what you wrote up about the horse's injury. What I wrote about Did it? Did you, you have a log, I assume, that you keep with regard to the horses that you board? I don't board horses regularly. This was a one-off situation. She was a companion horse for my horse because another horse went away, so they didn't like being alone. But it's not a regular thing. It's kind of like a roommate situation. Do you have a contract? Yes. I'd like to look at it. Okay. Your Honor. What? I uh, met the defendant uh, because she advertised a stall for rent, boarding stalls in Craigslist. How long did you keep your horse there? Uh, from January 13th, 2014 until So it was September. there for a very long time and yes. clearly you were satisfied. Yes. Otherwise you would have moved it. Right. Everything was Shh. fine up until it got hurt. Okay. This is your contract. Mm -hmm. And this says that if the horse becomes injured, which the horse clearly was, that it's your responsibility to first try to contact the border. Which I did desperately. Just a second. That's fine. And the second thing that you do is if you can't contact her, she gives you permission to contact her vet. Correct. Which you did. Correct. If the border's veterinarian is unavailable, the border authorizes the stable to call its veterinarian in an emergency and that the border will be fully responsible for all veterinary charges so incurred. So you really had the responsibility to call a vet, but it's her responsibility to pay. Right. Right? Absolutely. Correct. So the part of your request for vet bills, she's not responsible for those pursuant to this contract. You are. Right, Your Honor, but she, her boarding contract, she doesn't have a home occupational permit to run Just a boarding a stable in Simi Valley, and that's required to... Hey, you kept the horse there for nine months. Right. When did you have this epiphany that she wasn't allowed to do what she was doing? When did you have this epiphany? When you had a problem? I needed... What I'm telling you is you have a contract, and your contract says that you pay the vet bill. Right now, you owe her $325 because your horse was there in the month of September. Has I paid this happened? That. You paid it? Yes, I did. Great. How much did you pay her? I paid $325. I sent it to her through bill pay. Is that correct? It was cancelled. I have a, an email from my bank saying it was cancelled. I, I like cancelled it, at, Your Honor, after... So you owe her $325? No, I paid that. Her, she gave me a billing, Your Honor, uh, when I came. She to never pick up the horse, she said to you, you're not getting the horse unless you give me so much money. Right, and she added on erroneous Just charges a second. and add-ons. Just a second. How much money did you give her? I gave her $1,584. Okay. Now, now we come back to you. What is $1,584 for? It was, I have a line item billing of everything that I did for the horse, being that I had understood the horse was abandoned for the last two well, months. Well, I don't care what you understand, actually. I don't care what you understand. Seven days is not abandoned. She had not been to see that horse for months. Just, that's, that's not true. That's actually impossible because she right. told me that a month prior or two months prior, she had a conversation with you that she was moving the horse. I believe it was a text exchange. I don't care if it was text or by smoke signals. She had not been to the facility to I see don't, the horse. Listen to me, it doesn't matter. So far she owes you 325 for boarding for the month of September. I'd be happy to show you the billing with the receipts that I have. Take a look. She paid you in August. I apologize, it's just complicated because we had Just a, a second. Uh -uh. No way. No way. So, baloney, take it back. She owes you $325 because the horse hadn't been there the whole month of September, according to this, twice a month. She, she also paid hay in addition to the board. I understand that. And, and it, I fed her horse and I gave it medical care, which it was essential or the horse could have got an infection and been very sick.